the 131 kilometer Oshinene Okamatapati Road was officially opened by President Hage Gengo. It links Oshinene, Okonjati, and Okamatapati settlements to Port Fontaine. The, the development is set to mark the town as one of the primary economic hubs in the Oshodonjupa region. The road will also serve as a link to other southern countries. President Gengob said the infrastructure, built at a cost of $575 million, is meant to support government's development agenda. This is evident by the fact that in both the NDP4 and the Harambe Prosperity Plan, road infrastructure is identified as a key enabler for our developmental aspirations. The Roads Authority chairperson says the road was built to have a lifespan of 20 years and additional safety measures were installed to avoid car and pedestrian accidents. It is also common knowledge that good roads are vital to the future of our communities in rural areas. Good roads in better quality of life, guarantee of less hours in traffic and the promotion of road safety. With all these benefits, it is no surprise that the demand for roads in our country is bigger. The Oshodonjupa Regional Governor pleaded with motorists to use caution on the road and avoid fatal accidents by adhering to the rules and regulations of the road. A sound transport network enable efficient movement of people, goods and services. The facilities, uh, it facilitates domestic, region and international trade. In fact, the transport infrastructure is in the lifeline of our nation development.